Now, there, there are bacteria called extremophiles. These are bacteria that can live in environments like, you know, the hot ocean vents or, you know, around volcanic eruptions or in uh, sub-zero Arctic ice or deep in the Earth's crust where the, pre crust where the pressure is just insane. And this new study was published in Frontiers in Microbiology just this week. And, you know, most people think that their microwave is nice and clean because microwave radiation kills the bugs, right? Kills the bacteria. Turns out that's not the case. They, uh, they swabbed a bunch of microwave ovens in households, large, uh, shared large spaces and offices, and as well as some in used in laboratories, and sequenced the DNA. And what they found and what they discovered was over 101 bacterial strains growing in these, in these uh, microwave ovens. Uh, the main ones were Bacillus, Micrococcus, and Staphylococcus uh, genera. Or is that genera? I'm not sure. Um, and a few of them, uh, the bacteria, were associated with foodborne illness, including Klebsiella brevundiamosis, uh, are also growing in household microwaves. And uh, this is wild. I mean, the team suggests that the extremophile strains they found in the microwave ovens might have been selected evolutionarily by surviving repeated rounds of radiation and could have biotechnological applications such as bioremediation of toxic waste. Uh, but for the general public, the implications of the study are simple. A microwave is not a pure, pristine place, and they recommend that you clean out your kitchen microwave just as you would scrub your kitchen surfaces to eliminate bacteria. There